5,700 people in the Cypher PK Reddit, and we got this awesome custom Fortnite chapter four map concept. Dedicated 100 plus hours on this project known as Reality One. Not gonna lie, this is pretty impressive. When I first saw it, I thought it was some sort of leak. And I wouldn't even be upset if this was a chapter four map. It looks like it's got five different biomes, good amount of POIs, some map mobility, the negative zone with some purple like structures and environment. Probably gives you some special effects. It is a little bit small. That's what she said. <laughs> Just depends on the scale, right? This is all made from scratch. So it looks impressive. And guys, I, I, I truly do believe at this point that chapter four is right around the corner. I'm very excited for that. If that's the case, we are less than two months away from chapter four and from a potential chapter four map. That's crazy. Less than two months. I'm hyped. Oh, look at this custom Fortnite chapter four concept map. Spent over a hundred hours working on this. It looks so good. The negative zone, crater creation, slurpy sands. If you don't know, the rumor is we're going into chapter four next season. So these concepts are so cool to look at. And I'd be so hyped if there were some cool red areas, snowy areas, green areas. We'll have to wait to see what the chapter four map actually looks like. Okay, this is what I was looking for, all right? Rafo Comics is insane. This dude is absolutely insane. He created a custom chapter for map. We should make this a clip, actually. Let me, let me, let me just. So we've got Rafo Comics over here. He made a custom chapter for map and it took him 100 plus hours, all hand drawn from scratch. Look at this thing. Look at that. This looks like Apex Legends and Fortnite combined. We got like the Halo ring over here. You can see like the tubes that you can go into. And it's got like the kind of theme of Fortnite. I like it a lot. Niagara Falls in the middle. Why not? This is actually legit. I think he thought out a lot of this, so... I'm actually impressed. Yeah, I'm impressed. This is Tilted Towers over here? This map looks sick. I, I would love playing on this map. I feel like it would be a lot of fun. What's the other one he released? He released two pictures. Oh, he put names. Shoot, I should have opened that one first. So Deserted Dune, Manic, Mineshaft, Mount Dojo, Snowy Suburbs, Aegis Air, Crater Creation, Curvature Greenwood, The Negative Zone, Incel... Incel... Huh? Inselberg? Rifted Row, Stabilizer, Slurpy Sands, Marine Metropolis, and Best of Farm. I like it a lot, bro. You absolutely crushed it. This guy, like... I said I got tons of messages about the leaked Chapter 4 map. And people were 100% positive that this is the actual map. Let me show you the image here, and then we'll talk about it. So this is it. And as you can see, it is a well-drawn-out map. So what do we got here? We've got what appears to be three major biomes. We've got a lava section in the southwest. We've got the whole eastern side of the map being ice, and the whole northwest being desert. Now, of course, there's also some green on the southern aspect, but it's such an odd shape to the design that there's really only three biomes. But like I said, there is a lot of green and grass in the southern aspect, and then kind of in the northern northeast, there's some mountainous areas. But the three major ones are ice, sand, and lava. So before we go into more elaborate detail, this is from one of my friends on Twitter. And I've actually featured him on my channel before. So this comes from his video. So I don't know if people saw his video, took his screenshot and then removed his name and just said, hey, this is the chapter four map. I found it. But this is solely due to my friend. His name is Rafu Comics. And like I said, I've featured him on my channel before. What he does is design these awesome maps. And this is one of his designs. So all credit should be going to him. In fact, he did a video on this very map concept and I'm gonna link it in the description. I'm gonna link it in a pinned comment. I want you guys to go there and watch it because he goes into super detail. He's got these awesome, almost like 3D perspectives of the map. It's so cool. 
So he allowed me to make this video because he wanted to clarify that, hey, this is his concept. This is not a leaked chapter four map. This is his concept of a chapter four map. But it's so well done, it's just amazing, and he always has awesome background music as well. So I'm gonna link this very video, but he did allow me to go over the map. So I'm gonna show you the map and then go to his video to see all the other perspectives of it. It's worth it, trust me. Okay, so back to his map, let's take a look. So in the top northwest, he's got Manic Mineshaft, Deserted Dune, Marine Metropolis, and Slurpy Sands. I like that. Those are all unique names. And look at Slurpy Sands. Tons of Slurp Rivers nearby. That's amazing. Just like the POI we had in Chapter 2. So I like how spaced out everything is here. This is a well thought out Northwest aspect of the map. Go a little south. We've got Festive Farm. Always got to have a good farm on there. Rifted Row. That sounds like there's going to be tons of rifts in there. Then moving south, we've got just one POI, it's called the negative zone. That actually looks terrifying. I'm not sure what those big, almost fan-like circles are. It kind of looks like a dome. We'll have to check out his video to see what the heck those are. But that's a unique shape too. Almost looks like two lobster claws coming down there. Ha! <laughs> that's awesome. So moving on over, what else we got? In Selberg Point. I've never seen that word before in my life. In Selberg. I don't know what that means. I'm going to look it up right now. In Selberg. I wonder if I even said it right. Inselberg. Ah, I said it wrong. Inselberg. Inselberg. It says an isolated hill or mountain rising abruptly from a plain. Inselberg. Wait, is that how they said it? Inselberg. Inselberg. Okay. Interesting. So Inselberg Point. Well, that makes sense then. That is quite literally the definition of that word. So that's cool, a little mountainous region there. Stabilizer, looks like a giant waterfall. Then we've got Curvature Greenwood. That is actually pretty sweet. That's like the arch in St. Louis. Wow, I bet you could go up on that and laser people, that'd be so cool. To the right is Crater Creation. Interesting, a lot of potholes down there. Now going up into the ice area, we've got Snowy Suburbs, which is a little POI up there. The main one is huge. And it's A-E-G-I-S. So I always thought that was pronounced Aegis, but I just typed it into Google just to make sure I didn't sound dumb. And guess what? I am dumb. Here's how you really pronounce it. Aegis. Aegis. I never knew I've that. I've seen that word all the time and I've never known it was pronounced Aegis. 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 Okay, so it would be Aegis Air then. That is unique. This is the only part of the map, I don't know if I really like that there's just one giant POI here other than snowy suburbs. I kind of wish he made another one south. Like southeast of Aegis Air there. I kind of wanted to see another one like snowy suburbs up there. That would have been cool. So I don't know. To me it just looks a little bare over here. But you know we'd have to play it to see. Looks like there's a crashed ship right above snowy suburbs on the beach area there. And we've got Mount Dojo. That's pretty cool. It says it's a mountain but it's hard to tell from this perspective. I'm certain it is but... That's kind of like Lazy Lagoon. And that's about it. There's a few little islands to the left of that, kind of like Loot Lake. Very, very cool. What an awesome looking map. So again, this is a concept of the Chapter 4 Season 1 map. And this is by my friend, Rafu Comics. And we do speculate that Astria or Astria could be the Credit Mode 2.0 map or the Chapter 4 map. So really curious to see what you guys think about this down below. Now, this, con the, this concept of the backup dude was going around for quite a long time. And a lot of people thought it was actually legit, but it turns out it was made by this guy named Ref. Who makes or something like that over on YouTube and over on Twitter. So yes, this is definitely a concept in case you guys did not know this. This is not the Chapter 5 map.